Quail are such a great bird to add to your homestead, backyard, or patio, but it's important to know whether they actually make noises and if they're going to be keeping you or your neighbors up at night or just annoyed during the day. And the good news is that this animal that creates a little tiny tasty and packed with nutrients egg is actually not that loud. They do make a little bit of a noise and we're going to break down exactly what that's going to sound like when they make the noise and what gender actually makes a louder noise. And if you stay all the way till the end, we're actually going to show you some of our quail and I'll show you some of the noises that they do make so that you are fully prepared to purchase your own quail. What's great about quail is you're going to notice that the noise that they do make is going to be something that actually blends into many of the outdoor birds and wild birds that are already flying around outside. So even though they are going to make a noise, most of the time it's a sweet songful noise, which we are going to play in a bit. And it's definitely something that neighbors aren't going to get as up and roars about, say as whether you had a guinea hen or a rooster, as those are much louder, more abrupt sounds that ring to the sound of a common noise that you know. Now, the main reason that your quail are actually going to be making noise is usually if they're in a breeding season, the male quail are actually going to make more of a breeding noise, a mating noise, and this can happen throughout the entire night, throughout the day, as they call for their mates and they're ready to breed. You'll also notice that both male and females will make noises if they're unhappy, if they're in a new situation, or they sense that there could be fear or they just have high anxiety. Now, as we talked a little bit, the main differences in noises are actually going to be because of the gender. So a male is going to make more of a crowing noise. This is nothing compared to a rooster noise. It's definitely more of a songbird type noise. And it's going to be something that can alert the female that they're ready to mate. They're also going to make some tilling and crowing noises, just rummaging around their home. So there's definitely going to be noises that are coming out of them, but definitely nothing that's going to be super annoying or super loud as you would say say other game birds or other birds that you could be raising in your homestead or your backyard. Now let's actually talk about the female quails. So female quails are definitely going to make a lot softer noises than the male quails. They aren't really going to make the same type of noises that you would hear from the male of that crowing type of noise. They're more of a chirping. It's definitely a prettier noise and it's a lot quieter than that of the male. Again, still a lot quieter than that of any chickens that you might have. Now, something that you might know if you do raise chickens is that they usually will make noises as they're laying eggs and female quail do not do this, whether they are laying or just walking around, they're not going to be making a noise specifically to something that they're doing. The only time that they're really going to be making louder noises is when they are distressed, when they sense danger that's coming, when they have an anxiety or anything that's just uncomforting to them is when they are going to make a majority of their noises. So something to look out for, but for the most part, they're generally quiet birds, especially the female hens. One thing to think about is that you actually can help decrease some of the noises. So if you are finding that you have a really loud flock of quail, I think it'd be called a flock. I actually should probably look into that. But if you have a large herd of quail, a large flock, a large amount of quail, what you can do to lower the volume levels is make sure that you're dropping down the ratio of male to female quail. Males can be very territorial. And if you have a lot of them in one area with other males, they will be a lot louder. So you want to make sure that you have more of a one male to four female or one to six female ratio. And this is definitely going to decrease the sound of the quail noises that you have. Another thing that you can do is oftentimes people will actually separate their males and females into separate cages. And when you do this, the male is actually looking for his females and he will make noises to set on that he's looking for his mate. And they're going to be a lot louder 
when there isn't any females around. So by adding them into all one cage, doing that one to four, one to six ratio, it is gonna help cut down on a lot of that noise. And now for the part that you've all been waiting for, I'm gonna go ahead, bring you into our coop cage and let you hear a little bit of the noises that our quails are making. You're definitely gonna hear some of the crows of the males and some of the sounds of the females. We do have chickens as well, so if you hear some of them in the background, just know that they're kind of all in a similar area, so I can't super separate them out, but I will try to annotate some of the noises that you're gonna hear. That's it, thank you so much for watching and stay tuned because we're gonna be doing a lot more quail content coming up soon. So you're definitely gonna to wanna to hit that subscribe button if you aren't a part of the journey already. And we'll see you guys again next time. Bye.